So I'll start with what I've planted already. I don't remember what I've showed you, what I haven't. This is my new rose. I love my new roses. Um, this is a nice little pot I did for my mom. And she loves geraniums and these spiky grass things together. And I love the Goldilocks. And this is, I never say it right, Elysium, I think. I think I finally have it right, Elysium. Um, so these things are all being ready to plant. So tonight I plan on planting the bloom flower for the butterflies and the butterfly bush for the butterflies. So that's what I just dug the big hole for. Let's see what else I made. So this is a nice planter I made. So these are tropical plants that will grow up with the vines. Say hi to mom. Hi mom. Hi. All right. So we're also going to shuck corn. So I will there. shuck corn. Um, so these are some other planters I made for my mom from plants that she picked out. And I planted some of my herbs. So this is flat leaf parsley. And this is basil. I should remember because I made sure I used a pot that had a label that said basil. And that's my used to be baby cilantro. But now it kind of looks like a kid. It's not so little anymore. So it's growing up. This plant needed a rough, so I put it between two pots so it would get more shade. And yeah, I have a lot more planting to do, so that's the way that goes. Um, I have tons of soil. I don't have pots, but don't tell my mom that because she'll come home with a hundred of them. And I just filled the bird bath because they're kind of... It's been very dry. It's very nice out, but it's been very dry. So anyhow, that's that's my little world for now. Uh, oh, I didn't show you the hole. So, the hole I dug for the butterfly bush. Hopefully it's big enough, but if I have to dig it bigger, I will. Um, and it will be surrounded by a lot of these are raspberry bushes down here. And if you want a raspberry bush, if you have a backyard or a garden, let me know. I will send you some in the mail. Well, I got it in. It looks tiny now. Trust me, it will take over this whole area. This whole corner is going to be all butterfly bush. I can't wait. I forgot to leave out the most important part. I left off the most important part. I ordered caterpillars. So I am going to have little caterpillars that will grow into butterflies. And I'll put the link below. But um, I ordered it from Insect Lore. And I've ordered from them before. So you can buy the whole kit and the caterpillars all at once. Highly recommend it. If you're interested in it, go for it, man. It's awesome. It's so easy. They give you all the instructions, and you're doing a good thing. And as I'm talking, there's a, a bumblebee. And these are my raspberries. So we need the bees to pollinate, so we get nice raspberries. And normally we have them about the last week of school, right before the Ju July 4th. So, like, June 20th. Somewhere in there. So right before I get yelled at for not being inside for dinner yet, uh, I got the balloon flowers in. And they have lots of flower buds, so they will grow nice and tall and, and spread out. And in the meantime, I found this purple columbine. We have a bunch. My aunt used to have it, Aunt Joan. And uh, we took seeds from her many years ago. And we have some of these at school, I believe, in different colors. And they are native to New Jersey. Well, this has been fun gardening at night with Miss Falk. And I wish it was different circumstances. I'd say, come join me. But, you know, gotta wait till this stuff is over. Love ya. Miss ya. Hopefully you didn't see up my nose just now. But, whatever. Have a good one. Alright, bye.